Hey there YouTube, Gallagher123123 back with another iOS 16 video and in this one we're going to take a look at an enhancement that I think is long overdue and this is related to Wi-Fi and connecting and managing Wi-Fi. So most devices allow you to look at all the Wi-Fi networks you are connected to or you have connected to so you can remove them, remove the ones that you are not using. Well, that has not been possible on iOS. If you had a Mac and had Keychain enabled, you could do it that way, but you couldn't do it from the iPhone. Well, that is changed with iOS 16. Let's take a look. I'm going to go ahead and go into settings. Travel folder, non-apps, double tap settings, double Hit. tap to open. There are settings, I'll double tap. And settings. you want to go to Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi, Charlie Net 5, button, Wi-Fi. Now, another Switch related button. feature, which I'm going to start double with actually, is we're going to find which Wi-Fi network we're connected to. Selected, Charlie Net 5, weak security, secure network, signal strength, three or three bars. And that button. says, unfortunately, our security is weaker. But if I go ahead and swipe down more info. and double tap on more info, Weak security. tells us a bit about that. More about recommend to forget this network. We can forget this network as we could before. Auto join. Switch button on. Turn double on. Tap to toggle turn setting. on and off auto join. Password. But right there, if we double tap on this button, we can view the password for the network. Very cool. If you need to look up and actually see what the password is, you can do that now. But everything else data mode. Switch go data is mode. the same. You reload Switch data button. mode, private Wi Fi address, Switch button. Private wi -Fi address. Wi -Fi address. all the Nine, standard two, stuff eight. See, forget this network. that has been no. here before. So let's go back to the main Wi Fi screen. Wi -Fi. Now, if we go to the right after this Wi-Fi heading, edit button. we see an edit button. I'll go ahead and double tap this. Edit. Alert. Face not recognized. Okay, I want to try do, again. we need to do face ID. Try again. Try face ID again. Button. And I'm going to just tell it to try face ID again, so one second. Try face ID authenticated. Okay. Settings. Cancel. Button. So right away we're taken to a cancel button. Wi-Fi heading. And we have a Wi-Fi heading. Done. Did. Button. And we have a done button. No networks heading. And we have a heading here that says no networks. Button. Button. Ability mobile. Button. And this is an alphabetical list, I do believe. Ability Wi-Fi. Ability Wi-Fi five. A G underscore guest. Amazon zero one B. Amazon one hundred. Amazon twenty. Amazon J M four. But Amazon N Z. Amazon S zero N. So yeah. Those are some Amazon Echoes. Now I'm going to go up to a Wi-Fi network that I don't have um, in um, use um, anymore. Um, ability, ability wi -Fi button. And we'll select this one. Ability wi -Fi. Oops, okay, what we want to do actually is swipe down. Delete. We can delete this more info. or get more info. Forget this network. I'll do more info first. And the first option we have is forget this network. Auto join. Switch button off. Double we can tap to turn setting. on or off the auto join. Password. But here again, we have the password. So this time I'll show it to you since this is a network that we don't have anymore. I'll just go ahead and double tap on this. Password. CNNCTN 021600. And it reads it. And it did not ask for. A face ID. I'm assuming that's because we already did that to get into this list. Low data mode. Switch button. Low data mode. Have private Wi-Fi address. Switch button. So we have all the same controls at the bottom. DNS configured. HTTP 50 percent. 85 percent configured. Copy copy copy. Configure pro configured DNS. Well, we don't have anything at the bottom. So Wi-Fi. Back button. Let's go back. Wi-Fi. Ability Wi-Fi button. And if we swipe down. Delete. Let's delete Perform it. Perform action. Delete. Ability Wi-Fi 5. Ability mobile. Button. And it's gone. I'll delete, delete. this one too. Perform action. Delete. Ability Wi-Fi 5. Delete. Perform action. Delete. So AG underscore guest. Button. All of these I'm deleting. Amazon 01B. Amazon 1. Amazon 20. Amazon JM. Amazon N0. Amazon S. Amazon There's so many here. Amazon APHG. Apple demo. 
Apple Store button. That I didn't even realize my phone still remembers. So, but I've deleted the ones for now that I want to. So let's go back to the top. Wi-Fi hitting. And go to the right. Done button. And we'll say done. Alert. Remove Wi-Fi networks. And now it gives us a prompt about removing the Wi-Fi network. Your devices using iCloud Keychain will no longer join these Wi-Fi networks. And it says that our devices that are using iCloud Keychain will no longer see these and connect to these networks. So this will affect all of your devices. Cancel. Remove. Button. But in this case, I do want to remove these networks. So I will double tap on remove. Settings. Back button. Wi-Fi. And now we're just back in the main Wi-Fi settings area. Set settings. Back button. Settings. Settings. Hitting. All right. Well, that is just a quick look at now how you can manage your Wi-Fi networks in iOS 16, a long overdue feature in my opinion. This is something I'm kind of surprised, honestly, that we're just getting now, but at least we do have it. So if you have old Wi-Fi networks that you don't need anymore, so, you know, for me, I know when I was looking through it earlier, I discovered all the hotel Wi-Fis I still had. Things like the Mandalay Bay in Vegas and other places. You can now just get rid of them. Very nice feature. Oh, and the voice that I'm using in this video is Matilda Enhanced. One of the new Australian voices. Did want to make sure I got that in here. So with that, that concludes this video. Stay tuned for more. Thank you for watching. We hope you have enjoyed this video. If so, please subscribe for more, and feel free to comment. Also, you can follow me on Twitter, at Gallagher123123. Thank you for watching, and we will see you soon.